Hey, pleasant good day, everybody. This is Sports Night News. I'm Joe Borg, and this is going to be a quick video on the IIHF Worlds again as Team Kazakhstan was able to have a good game, too. They still lost to France, so are in very big fear of obviously relegation right now, heading into their games against Canada on the 19th and their next tilt that is going to be against Switzerland. But they did play the French very well, actually went up 1 to 0 in the game, but then the French come back and score the next two goals. Or in the first game, it just wasn't their day at all, obviously, for Kazakhstan as they got the floor wiped with them uh, 9 to 1 over Denmark as the Danes got a great start as Denmark routed them 9 to 1. And in net um, for Kazakhstan, it was Ilya um, Rumyansov, um, and then Sebastian Dom was in net for Denmark. Um, but Andre Shustov did start in net for Kazakhstan, where in game two, he was kind of the folk hero. He was the guy that was really good, really sharp, really poised. And he was a big reason Kazakhstan, in a game I thought France did deserve to win, but Kazakhstan did push the ante and push the pedal to the metal as much as they possibly could to put the French um, really have to have them step up and close out that game immensely as Texier and Florian were able to score. But when it comes to that first game, they weren't able to get anything going. They got shellacked. Um, and by the start of the second period, early into it, as Storm scored, it was already 4 nothing Denmark. And that was basically all she wrote in that game. But that's why these games are so interesting to pay attention to because you had such a bad game in the first game if you're Kazakhstan and lost 9-1 to to a solid uh, Denmark team. But then you come out in game two against France who's made a comeback against Slovakia but then fell 4-2 to two after the Slovaks had a very good closeout to score two in the final uh, period there. And then when it comes to this game, Kazakhstan was able to go up one to nothing as a Valery um, Oreshov, I think is how you say his name, was able to score as a Nikita McCullis was able to assist it and a blocker was able to assist it as well. So they were able to get the first goal. And also in this game, Andre Shushov, you want to see great bounce back from your goaltender, obviously got shellacked, wasn't good defense for Kazakhstan in that game against Denmark either. But he did have fantastic bounce back in game two against France as the French were able to prevail and have a very good closeout to this game. Their second period is what won them this game, but their team defense in the third also won them the game as Flory and Texier were both able to score as uh, Bussy also played good for France. But I think both goaltenders, Shutov and Bussy, deserve stars of the game in this one as Kazakhstan easily could have won this one if they just could have got. This was literally one of those games, the battle to the second goal in a goaltender battle. So this was a very good game for Kazakhstan. As they're one of two in good games, unfortunately for them, they're 0-2 record-wise, as they were not able to win the B-level game they played against France, where I think France played like a B-plus level, where they played the better game by a smidge, so the deserving team won. But overall, I do think Kazakhstan battled France more than some people thought they were going to, just like Austria really battled USA more than people thought they were going to. So great job by Kazakhstan to have a great second game. Unfortunately for them, their fear of relegation is now they have to beat Switzerland and Canada, and that's going to be a tall task. Peace out, everybody. Stay Or actually, I think they just have to beat one and then go to OT. But peace out, everybody. Stay safe. Please do subscribe down below or up above on the easy to use widget to keep the channel growing to the goal of 250 or more by the start of June.